G'day guys, we're at the field on a beautiful day and I've got to get the uh, Alpha Strike in the air. It's a great day to do it. It's just gathering satellites at the moment. Um, so this is my little test project to try and get up to 200 kilometres an hour without losing the craft. Don't know if we'll do it today, but we're going to give it a shot and see what sort of speeds we can get out of this one. We're running a 6 cell 1800 milliamp battery. It's a ZOP power battery with 85 C rating battery. Other than that, that's pretty much all. It's just gathering satellites. Um, I'm going to be giving you some FPV feed, hopefully. Uh, we've got five satellites at the moment, so it's still gathering a few more, and then we'll get into the air. So, yeah, join us on this flight, guys. Could be a bit of fun. We'll see what we can do. All right, it's got 10 satellites now, so we're, we're right to go. Going to probably run this one in, in horizon mode, I think. We'll start off in angle, and then we might flick over to horizon. Plane could probably do a little bit more bank angle. Just gonna back it off a little bit here. Horizon. Pretty touchy. Put a little bit more, um, more of a curve on the expo, I think. Well, let's get some speed into it and see what we can get. get. Ten minutes. I'm only at 60% throttle here. Angle. Let's stick it back in angle. Horizon. It's 
Okay, a 36% battery, we'll have to bring it in soon. I think they might do us guys, I think we'll have to have to bring it in. Angle. Just gonna flick back in angle here. So we're down to 23% battery. Don't want to push it too much. And I don't want to 21% battery now, so I'll do one more pass. Just up it down a bit. Need to be able to find this plane. There it is. All right, come in for a landing. Could come in pretty hot this plane, I think. Lovely. <laughs> Worked out pretty good. good <clears throat> Fun plane to fly, that one. Well, we reached 176 kilometres an hour, so that was pretty good. That's the personal best for it. I think we need a different prop on it, though. I've got a feeling so that could be what we look at doing next. I'll just go and grab the plane. Pretty good run. It's a good plane to fly. Fun plane to fly. Still got a fair bit more in it. I just feel the, the prop might be letting it down a little bit. Especially after, maybe you get up to about 60% throttle, 70%, and um, it doesn't seem to have a huge lot more. It seems to spin up a lot, but doesn't seem to be gaining a great deal in speed. So 176, that was going at 100% throttle. Not for a great deal of time. Like I said, it, it sounded like it was maybe spinning a bit in its own prop wash, possibly. I don't, I don't know. But anyway. The prop I'm using, too, is a gem. How's the battery feel? Battery feels fine. It's not hot or nothing. No, it's not hot either. And the ESC is warm, but nothing. Yeah, no, it's not even hot. Not even warm, so yeah, excellent. So this prop, it's a gem fan prop, that's all I know. I think it's a 6x4, from what I remember. I don't know, maybe we'll try a different style prop and give it a shot, I don't know, we'll see. Other than that, uh, it's a great plane to fly. So back on the workbench here now, uh, I'm just going to run over a few things here on the craft as it currently is. So I'm going to eventually get rid of this FPV system here. It's just a run cam analog system, which um, you saw in the video. I want to upgrade it to the Walksnail Avatar 1S Lite, which I've also got in uh, my drift here. And I don't mind it, it seems to be quite a good light. Uh, it's the lightest out of all the cameras and VTXs, so that's the way I want to go with this one too. Just not sure how it's going to go with the cooling side of things. Ideally, that would be the best spot in here uh, for the most optimum cooling, but I don't know how we're going to go with all our cabling and that. You don't seem to get a lot of length in those uh, camera cables. So we're running the F405TE board from Matec. It's running iNav 7.1 currently with a 60 amp ESC and running Express LRS here on its Happy Model 900 receiver. Like I said before, we've got a six and a half inch prop here and the motor that this has got in it is a 1800 kV motor in it. 
Currently its FPV system is a TX1200 Esheen analog VTX running running the run cam here I'm not sure which run cam it is but I've, I've forgotten it's been a while but like I said that's all going to be replaced into high definition uh, camera uh, in the coming months so coming up I'm going to go into iNav and show you the, uh, the setup that I've got on this plane currently uh, for this flight copy what you want at your own risk so I don't recommend it do your own tuning and your own uh, setups because everything's different but this is how I've got this set up I want to document it for my own purposes uh, to see exactly how I'm running the, this craft for this video anybody wish to suggest any changes to this craft it's more than welcome I'm more than open to it it's a testing in progress this plane and it's quest to top the 200 kilometer an hour barrier I'm running 6s so all comments are welcome as long as it's constructive for everyone that's watching the video I'm going to leave it with you here and just let INAV do its piece so you can see how this craft is set up enjoy guys